Hey everyone, here's a question from exercise 4.3, third question. This is last question from chapter basic geometrical ideas of classics. So in this question, they're asking us to draw a rough diagram of a two angles such that they have, and there are few conditions here. So we, they want a two angles which they have one common point, one point in common. So here will be the first one. Now two angles, only one point common, in that means there should be exactly one point common, right? So we're going to take a two intersecting lines like this. Now you can see there are four angles forming out, but we're going to specify which two angles because you're asking two angles where one point is common. So if I take a two angle side by side, then uh, there will be like, um, uh, there will be more than one point, the chances of more than one point common, right? So we cannot go for that. So we're going to take a two angles. Let me just draw this. Okay, so suppose there is a point here. This is point A. This is point B. This is point C. This is point D. And at the intersection, I'm taking it as point O. Right? Now they want only one point common. So if you see this angle, that is angle A, O, B, an angle C O D. So O is a one point which is common. Now I cannot take a two adjacent angle that is side by side like B O A and A O D I cannot take. If I take a two angle side by side then there will be two points common right like O and A will be common in that case but they are asking only one point. So here uh, O is common point O is a common point that is only one point common point in angle AOB and the next angle is COD, COD, that's it. Then the next question, now in this question they are asking uh, to two points in common. Now I am going to take a same figure here, that is for B also it is the same figure, I am not changing it. If in case they ask you in this question, you can draw the same diagram or you can draw, uh, uh, let me draw another one. You can pick up the same diagram for the first one, but the angles will be different. Or if you want, you can draw like this. Suppose I have an angle here, like, uh, okay, this is a straight line and here are the two angles, okay. Now I'm taking the two angles side by side because you want two points in common, right? Now suppose this is a point A. This is point B here and this is point C here and this is a point O, the intersection point is O. Now you can see two angles side by side that is AOB and uh, uh, BOC. They are asking two points in common. If, if you see these two, uh, two angles, there are two points common. That is one point is O, another point is B because this arm is common, this ray is common for both the angles, right? That is AOB and B O C. So this arm um, or this ray is common and there are two points O and B which are common. So there will be two points. So B and O are two points common in angle A O C and sorry not AOC it is AOB and BOC and angle BOC right I hope this is clear now next question they're saying three points in common now what you can do is I'm going to use the same figure that is for the bigger uh, for the well, second question that is B question and I'm going to just change the question my uh, question here it is question C now they're saying three points in common, right? So three points in common means on the same line. So we have a two angles AOB and BOC. And uh, here you can see B and O, right? This arm B and O. Uh, here you can take another point. So let us take a point here, D. Now you can see the three points, that is B, D and O. So same one, same answer. You can just add another point that is D. So D. B and O are the three points. Instead of two points, it will be three points. You have to just keep on adding the points on the same arm because OB is a common arm there. You can keep on adding the points there. So this will be three points. Now the next one is uh, they are asking four points. So you can take another point on this, which is which will be point E. So you can write down 
E, D, B and O are the four points. Instead of three points, now you take it as uh, four points. That's it. This is fourth question. There are four points which are common for the angle AOB and AOC. So, so the figure will remain same, only number of points you have to keep on add on this. And the next question, one ray in common. So again the same figure. If you see here AOB and BOC, OB is a common ray. Yes, OB is a common ray, it's a common arm. So answer for the E is also will remain same. So I'm going to erase this part. I hope it is clear what I'm solving here. So this is the last question. The figure will remain same. I'm just adding up the points. And here instead of uh, D and E, if you want, you can keep it or you can remove it. You can see OB is a common ray. So you can write down OB is a common ray. OB is a common ray uh, for angle or for angle AOB and A or sorry BOC. That's it. So I hope this question is clear. In case you have further question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.